there are a number of genetic changes which might promote abnormal cell division and cancer. One of these could be a mutation of the genes for the hormone or growth factor so that they are overproduced. If a body simply produces too much growth factor, then this might uh, cause otherwise abnormal cells to now divide abnormally. Now notice this would not be the production of an abnormal protein, just too much of a normal protein. So some people have cancer because of overproducing the growth factors which cause cell division. Other mutations might affect growth for different reasons. For example, some mutations might affect the genes for the receptors for the growth factor. Some cells might produce simply too much. So if a cell overproduced these receptors, they would be overly sensitive and divide more frequently than they should, once again because they are overproducing a normal gene, in this case the receptor for the growth factor. Other mutations might cause a cell to produce the wrong receptor, so that, for example, a cell that shouldn't divide when estrogen is present makes estrogen receptors and does. Usually, a receptor can only activate a cell after it has bound a hormone or growth factor, but some mutant receptors are the exception. They can stimulate cell growth and tell cells to divide, even when they haven't bound a growth factor.